I don't particularly like air pumps because they're noisy. So, I've got here a different kind of a pump that I'd like to show you today. It's called a Trump. And it's spelt T-R-O-M. And I'm using it to run a Tesla valve airlift, which pumps up the water from the bottom and spits it out the top. To do that, I need compressed air. And this is why I don't want to use an aquarium pump because they're really noisy. So what we're using here is a water pump. And this is, uh, this is not a diaphragm pump, which are, is also noisy. This is a transfer pump. It's a centrifugal pump, which has blades that go like this, that is used to transfer fluids under low pressure. A trump can do the same, and it uses water to convert that to air, which powers the airlift. So how does the trump work? Well, in the old days, they used to have waterfalls that would send water down a venturi, that's a venturi, and it would go all the way to a separation chamber where bubbles would then come back up and the air would be separated from the water. This air in here becomes compressed and feeds whatever tool you need. Tromps used to get uh, over 100 psi, but we don't need 100 psi for this little pump. So we only need about 0.2 to 0.5 psi. So, and that's in this range here. This is our handy dandy psi gauge, which is attached to the trump, and it gives us a, a real-time indication of what the pressure is in the trump. This is how much compressed air that um, uh, we're generating for the airlift. So how does this work? What we're looking at here is two tubes. One is a, the outer one is a one inch tube. And inside the one inch tube is a half inch tube. This is a half inch tube, but there's another one inside. And the half inch tube guides the falling water to the separation chamber. And the separation chamber takes out all the bubbles which eventually come up here and pop, creating compressed air up here, which flows down to there. Trumps are very simple in operation, but they're very hard to calculate, so I can't show you the equations for this. This has all been sort of like created on the fly based on uh, trial and error. Um, Trumps in the old days used to be like next to waterfalls that were like a lot of water. But we don't need waterfalls. All we need is to recirculate the water from the trump back up to the top and it keeps going in a big circle and training air through the venturi and bring it to the separation chamber where it bubbles up into compressed air. So the water in the trump is completely separate from the water in this bucket. In fact, I can pull this out so that you can see that it's just air. See, there's no water coming out of here. But if I put this back in here, you'll immediately see that there's bubbles coming out here, so it's just water. I'm sorry, I meant to say, it's just air. Anyhow, um, that's the basic design of a trunk. Thanks for watching.